Hello everyone. In this video, we have this nice radical equation. We have the cube root of x to the power fourth root of x is equal to 1 over square root of 2. And we have to find the value of x. But before we begin, if you are new here, please consider subscribed and also don't forget to like this video. Thanks a lot for subscribing. Now let's get started. So from here we have the cube root of x to the power the fourth root of x is equal to 1 over square root of 2. Now let's raise each side of the equation to the third power, okay? So that this one will cancel this. Now we have x to the power the fourth root of x is equal to, now this is the same as 1 over square root of 2 or to the power 3. From indices, if you have square root of a or to the power b, this is the same as square root of a to the power b. In the same way, if I have square root of 2 or to the power 3, this is the same as square root of 2 to the power 3. And this is also the same as square root of 8. So in place of square root of 2 to the power 3, I'm going to put square root of 8. So this becomes x to the power fourth root of x is equal to 1 on square root of 8. And this is also the same as x to the power fourth root of x is equal to 1 on 8 or to the power 1 half. Now let's take fourth root on both sides of the equation. All right. Now, just like we did earlier, if we have square root of a to the power b, this is the same as square root of a or to the power b. From this side, I can write it as the fourth root of x or to the power fourth root of x. And this is equal to, I can also write this as 1 on 8 or to the power one half, then all to the power one over four. Okay, so we have the fourth root of x or to the power the fourth root of x, and this is equal to now from this side, if you have a to the power m or to the power n, this is the same as a to the power mn. Okay, so from here, I can multiply the whole of this by this. And this becomes 1 on 8 or to the power 1 on 8. Okay, now, if I have a to the power a equals b to the power b, then I can say that a is equal to b. From this side, you can see that the base is equal to the power. And then this side to the base is equal to the power. So it's just like this one. Okay. So I can say that fourth root of x is equal to 1 on a. Okay. Since we want to find the value of x, let's raise each side to the fourth power. Okay. So that this one will cancel this. Now we have x is equal to 1 to the fourth power is still 1 over a to the fourth power and a to the fourth power is also the same as 2 to the power 3 or to the power 4 and this is also the same as 2 to the power 12 so in place of a to the power 4 i'm gonna put 2 to the power 12 so we have x is equal to 1 on 2 to the power 12 so this is our final answer. Let's go ahead and then verify our answer. As you can see, I have copied down the question. 1 over square root of 2 is approximately equal to 0 0.707. Okay, so plugging this into the equation, we have the cube root of 1 on 2 to the power 12 or to the power the fourth root of 1 on 2 to the power 12. 
If you use a calculator to punch this, you'll be getting approximately 0 0.707. Okay, so use your calculator to punch this one and then let me know the answer in the comment section. I hope you found this video useful. Please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thanks a lot for watching. See you again on the next video.